The town of Khaidarkan is located in the Pamir Alai Mountains of southern Kyrgyzstan and on the outskirts of the Fergana Valley at an elevation of 2,000 meters above sea level. Visitors can reach Khaidarkan from the Kyrgyz capital, Bishkek, in 15 hours by car. This geopolitically sensitive region, featuring various ethnic groups, has a long history in mining. For more than 70 years, the Khaidarkan mercury plant extracted ore from open pit and underground mines. The operations have been the main source of income in the town of 10,000 people. The overall output over this period is about 45,000 tons of metallic mercury, about half the primary mercury produced by the former USSR. The production at all Kyrgyz mines reached a peak of 800 tons per year in the 1980s. Similarly, the population of Haiderkan had its peak in the same period. Although the number of mine workers strongly decreased in the two past decades, the town population remained less affected. Today, Haiderkan remains the world's last producer of industrial mercury that continues to export mercury across the world. Mercury, also known as quicksilver, is a heavy silvery white metal which is liquid at room temperature and evaporates easily. In nature it's usually found in the form of cinnabar, used in the past as a red pigment. Mercury can seriously harm human health and it is a particular threat to the development of fetuses and young children. It affects humans in several ways. It damages the central nervous system, thyroid, kidneys, lungs, immune system, eyes, gums and skin. Research in the past showed high mercury levels in urine and blood of Haidarkan residents, as well as a number of mercury-related diseases among professionals. Mercury is also a global threat due to the length of time it can remain in the atmosphere and travel huge distances before secondary deposition. In Haidarkan, large amounts of industrial waste were generated around the plant during the decades of its operation. As mercury-rich waste is uncontained and easily accessible for humans and animals, it poses considerable risk via groundwater, air and local products contaminated with mercury. Research has shown that in particular around the smelter and the tailings dam, a lot of mercury can be expected in the soil and water. This is mainly due to the obsolete equipment used for mercury production and waste storage. Several technical approaches are required to reduce the environmental risk that these sites, including the safe relocation of contaminated materials, application of safety covers and fencing off high-risk sites. The goal of all these measures is to minimize contact between humans and mercury-contaminated material. Because of the negative effects mercury can have on humans and the environment, the international community, including Kyrgyzstan, agreed to phase out mercury globally through signing the Minamata Convention. As a consequence, the need for mercury in the world will decrease and mercury mining in Khaidarkan will also phase out eventually. The future of Khaidarkan thus largely depends on how mercury production can be replaced with safer economic activities. The main object is to sustain people's livelihoods beyond mercury mining in an environmentally safe manner.